Now, there was a television studio inside that theater, and the vice president in charge of everything was Mr. Coco Nutwork, the one-man network. On the air! From Big Apple City, we present the Big Bake Off. Starring Strawberry Shortcake and the peculiar Purple Pie Man of Porcupine Peak. And the Big Bake Off judge himself, Coco Nutwork. Here's Coco. Thank you, thank you. Contestants, check your stove. Mine's just pinchy. Oh, mine's covered with ice. More like a refrigerator than a stove. <laughs> Goodness, we need a scientist to fix that. Try and find one. <laughs> T, you're a scientist. Quite. Stiff upper. Allow me. Have a go at it. Why, it's all fixed. Smash what? Carry on. You bet. Nya, 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 nya. I'm way ahead of you. My batter's already mixed. Soon my cold rabbi cookies will be baking in that stove. <laughs> hey, Everybody's a critic nowadays. Ah, go ahead, strawberry. Mix your batter. Oh, someone's been tampering with my ingredients. Instead of milk, I've got chalk water. Axle grease instead of butter. Plaster instead of flour. And bubble gum instead of strawberries. Somebody's got to get to the supermarket quick. Caramba! We must save Strawberry. They'll never get back in time to help you. <laughs> never say never. Look! Sorry we took so long, but there was a line at the checkout counter. Now to make my delicious strawberry shortcake. Egad. <laughs> Even more bad guy stuff is called for. Look me in the eye. You are growing sleepy. Very sleepy. Kohlrabi cookies are the num num nummiest things of the world. A natural winner. Kohlrabi cookies win. Kohlrabi cookies win. But, but, but you haven't even tasted my... Nonsense. I win the gazebo, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> goody, goody butterballs. Well, give it to me. One moment. First prize is this lovely gazebo, made of the finest wood from the gazebo forests of New Jersey. The walls open up to reveal a little gazebo wardrobe and dressing table. Not fair. Cheat, cheat. Sticky wicket. Unfelicitous. This mold... He smells a rat. Now, we've all got to be good losers. Remember, the victory lies in the struggle, not in the prize. But he didn't even taste one of the kohlrabi cookies. You know, you're right. <laughs> yeah! Call a doctor. Call an ambulance. Call the Marines. Call them all. Tasty short cakes. Please, sir. Ah, wonderful! The strawberry shortcake wins. The gazebo is yours. Oh, oh thank you! Oh, thank you so much! <laughs> <laughs> well, strawberry not only won the contest. But Mr. Coco Network came up with a wonderful offer. You want me to have my own TV series? Yes. I can see it now. The Mary Berry Show! You'll be the toast from coast to coast. Oh, I'm honored, Mr. Network. Very, very honored. <laughs> <laughs>
Egad! Not only do I lose, but I've got to watch that merry talk on TV! <laughs> well, do you accept? Gee, I'm tempted, but... Golly, then I think of Strawberry Land and all my old friends. Huckleberry Pie and Blueberry Muffin and Plum Pudding. Raspberry Tart and Apple Dumpling and... and oh, I don't know. I guess I'm just a country girl. I want to go home. We have decided we'd like to go home with you also. Oh, you're all welcome to come. And, and then I won't have anybody to miss. Except me. I want to go too. Give up the brat race and live in Strawberry Land. <laughs> but... Who would run the network, Mr. Network? Well, as punishment for your evil deeds, I hereby make you new vice president in charge of everything. Oh, no! Oh, vice president? Oh, that's a fate worse than Betty Talk! And so off they all went. Back to good old Strawberry Land. Strawberry Land, not mighty, not grand, where no one.